So what we've got in here is the first two on the right hand side here. Now your before swings from face on and looking down the line. This one is a face on view of your practice swing to show the difference in the swing yeah. and your grip. And then a down the line view so we can see your right foot movement mainly. Okay, so setup wise here was pretty good. But I say grip was a little bit underneath. You should probably see some sort of movement there with the fingers where you sort of went back. Fingers opened up. Yeah. I don't mind you doing that. Just get comfortable. That's absolutely fine. Okay, but once you've got once that you there now, keep it there. What you did was kind of I think on this one, there, yeah. open the fingers there now. As you re grip it, the club was then starting to go back. Okay, yeah, so it's making sure we're getting the hands on the club securely, they're not moving around. Okay, yeah, and then in terms of the back swing that you had, there's the fingers going, and we know the swing's going to start now, gripping it. And as you're doing that, your left hand, look at your left hand's moving towards your left leg here. Yeah? So your hands are moving forward. Now you're trying to turn the golf club back while you regrip it. And that's just going to never really create any consistency. Yeah. The club's moving. And it's sweaty hands, heat condition. It's going to make it tough, okay? Yeah. And then here's your backswing. There's your shoulder turn. Yeah. There's your club position, okay? So this is the trill, the practice movement now, okay? So better grip. Get those fingers on the club there nicely. They can move around until you get comfortable, but mm -hmm. keep them on there. There's your backswing. So you're nice yeah. and centred. How much further? How much further on oh, the arm? Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. that's kind of going from like ten o'clock to almost twelve o'clock in terms yeah. of your arm. Is using that reference point there, okay? So a much fuller swing, and then right the way through to target. And then back around here to looking down the line. Did the same good back swing there, okay? So we see that back swing position there. Compare that to down the line. Yep. There you go. See the fingers almost there again as they go back. Hang on. There they are, <laughs> there they go, and the club goes back. And again, you weren't even aware of that, obviously. No, not at all. And there's your kind of just lift with the arms and no torso. So that was your back swing before. Yeah. That's your back swing yeah. at the moment now. Again, this is obviously practice swing, which is yeah, we, yeah. we expect to be a little bit easier to make because you're not thinking, okay? Mm -hmm. And we set to that golf ball. Again, like I said, don't mind your fingers moving and resetting just so you get comfortable, okay? Mm. You do all the thinking in your practice swings. Big turn. Yeah. Lift those arms up nice and high, okay? When you get to it, the golf ball, it's like, okay, your back swing that's a great position really now as you sort of come back to the golf ball good strike the ball there down the middle he's moving look at that footwork there left foot stays on the ground yeah that's that's more the movement you've seen on tv in it rather than yeah 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 i was gonna say that uh, movement more I can get face on, the more the foot will come yeah, anyway, wouldn't it? Of course yeah. it would. Yeah, I mean, yeah. yes, it's hard. The thing is, yeah. when you do things correctly, these move anyway. It's hard yeah. not to move that foot. If you do that there, now you pop your knee out and turn your right foot. It's, it kind of wants to move, okay? So yeah. getting your body to move there as you go through, okay? If you hang back on it and the left foot lifts, you learn to get some reasonable shots there, but they're going to want to pull to the left, okay, with that grip and that swing. So yeah. therefore, you created a movement to try and almost push out to the right and almost hold that club straight. Two wrongs left, they're going to wrong right, Mike Eagle straight. Mm. Worked with this club <laughs> with a longer club trying to time those three things. Yeah. Driver's just good play. Yeah. If we can say, right, there's a target, there's a target, I'll swing towards target rather than it's going to go left, it's going to go left, it's going to go right. And then when you're playing well, you get the same shot over and over again, it clicks. Yeah. When you're not playing so well, it's like a very much play team. Okay. <laughs> so getting that movement better. But as I say, the main thing is to be in terms of your practice swings. This part here now is when you're thinking, okay? You can think about stretching, squeezing, a big movement, okay? Right the way back and then right the way through, yeah? Make these movements here because no balls in the way, it doesn't matter. You can think as much as you like. Yeah. Once you're going through all that prep work, and again, this, this, this sort of movement starts here now at zero and you're just about getting set there now, okay? You actually hit the goal ball about 45, 50 seconds, yeah? So every shot then should take that amount of time. I generally look at a ball a minute, yeah? Yeah. So you give yourself 45 seconds in that prep work, okay? Hit the ball, look at it, enjoy it. Yeah. Get the ball back in, drag another ball in from the side. Do the same again. If you just okay. go, ba-doing, 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 A, you'll sweat like buckets. Yeah, yeah. And all you're going to really get is cardio workout <laughs> rather than actually working on something specific, yeah? yeah. Practice yeah, yeah. swings are powerful and they will, they will affect how well you hit the golf ball, yeah? Yeah. Okay, make, make sense? Yeah. Good stuff.